Welcome to another quick and easy mentalism trick. This time we're using ESP cards. Obviously you've seen these before. We'll do a little shuffle. Okay, we're going to deal them out into two even piles. Square them up. Two spectators. The pile they choose is the pile they'll use. So let's say they chose this pile. Okay, spectator number one can cut it anywhere he wants. And he has a choice, he or she has a choice of the top card or the bottom card. Let's say they chose the bottom card. And again, that's a free choice. I'm deal these cards out. Spectator's two pile. He makes, they make their uh, cut anywhere they want, free cut anywhere they want, and they have the choice of bottom or top. Let's say in this one they chose the top card. You deal their cards on top of spectator number one's cards. Put their uh, square them up. I'm gonna put their uh, matchings over here. Now. My job is to get a psychic feeling of one set of cards. I'm going to choose this pile. No, this... Mm, I'll choose this one. Let's see what I chose. I chose the wavy lines. Two wavy lines. Let's see what the spectator's free choice chose. Amazingly, two wavy lines. They match exactly. And now the tutorial. ESP cards are set up in a specific order. Circle, cross, wavy lines, square, star. And they're repeated in that same order throughout the deck 25 times. So what you want to do is take a set out, a circle, cross, wavy lines, star, and throw one set out so you only have 20 cards. You want to do a little overhand shuffle. And when you do a little overhand shuffle, this does not affect the order whatsoever. Next, you deal mode into two piles. And this trick is pretty well self-working. Okay, first spectator has a choice of either pile, it doesn't really matter. Let's say they choose this pile. They can cut the pile anywhere they want. Again, that doesn't affect the order and they have their choice of the bottom card or the top card, that's also a free choice. We'll just turn that one up for now. Spectator 2 can do the same thing. Freely cut their pile anywhere they want. Chose the top card or the bottom card. Let's say they chose the top. So this time it's a plus, whoops, plus and a uh, circle. You take the first spectator's cards, you deal them out right across from left to right. And again, this trick is self-working. Just follow the instructions, pretty straightforward. Take the second spectator's cards, and deal their cards right on top of spectator number one's cards. In the same fashion, left to right. And just chose the center uh, card packet. It's always gonna be in the center. There are nine cards left, the center is number five. One, two, three, four, five. Chose that, and it'll match every time. Self-working. Enjoy. Quick and easy self-working mentalism trick.